congratulations on the show. It's getting the most rave reviews. People are absolutely loving it, and rightly so. Um, Kerry, for anyone who hasn't caught it yet, tell us what the show's about and, and, and who you both play. So, the show is about a family, um, and it's about um, a man who is a dad and a grandfather, and he is coming home after spending more than a decade in prison. And it's about what it's like to try to re-enter society and re-enter a family, and what it's like to love somebody who's re-entering society and re-entering a family, and how you find your way with each other. So obviously it's about, it's about a, a dad and a daughter and a grandson. I'm obviously the daughter, he's the father and, and grandfather. How, and how do we repair? Yeah. Mm -hmm. How do we repair the relationship that has been, um, that has suffered a lot of slings and arrows over the years. There's a lot of work to do in terms of gaining my daughter's trust, mm -hmm. trusting each other. Learning right. how to live together yeah. after yeah. our relationship has been through a phone. Yeah. It's, it's a brilliant, brilliant premise. And, and uh, Delroy Carey said that you were the only choice the only to choice. play this part. Um, how does that feel when you, when you heard that? It's incredibly affirming. I mean, gratifying, affirming, not only uh, I didn't know that until I got on. We, we had a Zoom call, right? Mm -hmm. uh, and Carrie made it clear that she wanted me to play and, and why she wanted me to play the part. And it's, um, I don't recall what I thought at the time, but what I can tell you now is it's, it's deeply affirming and gratifying. Did you get told that after you'd agreed the money? <laughs> that's, that's my thought. Is... Very rarely does someone say, no. there is no one else can play, yeah. this is just you. Because yeah. then you're like, oh, OK. <laughs> right. Let's get no, that but, Hulu money. But so we, did say, we did say, you're the guy. You're yeah, the, you're you the one we want. You're, from the jump. You're the one from we the, want. And I, and I remember getting top. off the call when he said he was interested in thinking, now we have a show. Now, Kerry, your character has something which uh, is called main bitch energy. <laughs> a main bitch energy. What is that? <laughs> How can I get some? <laughs> well, How can I get some of this main so bitch it's energy? it's really, I have to credit Delroy. It's a line that our brilliant writers wrote on the show, but his character delivers, where he says to me, he says to his daughter, you are a main bitch. And it's such a beautiful moment where you get to see how sometimes your parents don't tell you exactly what you want to hear in the way you want to hear it, but what they're saying still has so much meaning and love and is the right thing at the right time. So you can get some with this T-shirt. Oh, so look at this. Main bitch T-shirt. media you can get the link but we made these t-shirts because so many people love that phrase they love the idea of you don't have to be the supporting character in the story of your life you are the don't protagonist the support, of bitch. your no you don't want to be the side I'll piece be honest, the academy awards would have been so much better i mean and the oscar the, the, for the side piece supporting bitch <laughs> Award. You want to be the yeah. main bitch. Bitch of photography. But I, yes, but I have yes. to say that <laughs> if I walked into my house with that T-shirt, I would get slapped. Yeah. <laughs> well, my mother's not. Thrilled. My mother loves the show, week. but she does not love this shirt. But that's well, okay. I, it's I, amazing. Can I be honest? I can't. I'll have to wait until after this show's done. I can't wear this to work whilst Winnie works here. <laughs> because Winnie right there, you see Winnie here yes. just waving. Yes. Winnie, yeah, Winnie. Winnie is the main bitch of the Late Late Show. Yes. Yeah.